everyone, my name's Olivia. I'm a CYC student in my second year. Today we're gonna make a little St. Patrick's Day craft. We're gonna make some binoculars. So what you're gonna need is two rolls of toilet paper or paper towel roll cut in half, some pipe cleaner, some gold and some green, a string of any color of your choice, some pom-poms of any color of your choice, some green paint, a paintbrush and some hot glue. You're gonna need assistance with an adult for the hot glue. To start this craft, we're gonna get a piece of paper or a bag to put underneath and we're gonna paint these paper towel rolls. So we're gonna open the paint and dip our paintbrush in and then we're just gonna start painting the outsides of these. Once that one's done, we're going to move on to the next one. It's easier if you just stick your fingers in and then you're not really touching the sides. Then one, and now when you're done painting all of the brown on the paper towel rolls, we're just gonna leave it, set it aside and let it dry. It shouldn't t take too long to dry. Now that these are dry, we can start decorating them and then glue them together. So what you're gonna wanna do is have your pom-poms and your pipe cleaner ready so you can decorate however you would like. So we can start off by plugging in our hot glue gun. Make sure that you have an adult to assist as it can get very hot. So I'm just gonna make a line around the top of this and start putting the pipe cleaner on. might be easier if you just do one big circle and then stick it all on. It might stick better. It might not be as hard. And then with your scissors, you're just going to cut the excess off and then it will line up perfect. This shouldn't take very long to dry and that's what it should look like at the end of it. And then I'm gonna go on and do the other one. And if this one doesn't fit around perfectly, that's okay, but it looks like it does. So we're gonna do the other one here. Once the first one is done, we're gonna go and do the second one here. I'm just gonna do it all the way around this time. And stick it on like this as the glue is actually really hot so you are gonna want an adult to help you with this part and it should look like that and it will dry in a few seconds and then just to be make it a little more fun I'm gonna put the green one on the end so I'm just gonna cut it in half and then do one at a time. Make sure that you're setting the hot glue gun on something that's not gonna wreck your table or your floor or wherever you're doing this craft. Just grab it, bend it, pull it all the way around. If you need to, you can put a little extra glue just to hold the ends together. Like that. And then move on to the next one. And 
You can like pre-bend it if you would like. It might make it a little bit easier to stick to the glue. There we go. Then I'm going to, now that it's dry, I'm gonna glue them together. Just put a lot of glue right down the side of it. And then grab them and then just stick them together. Might need to hold them for a few seconds. And then it's dry. Then you can add some pom poms. I'm just gonna put a few dots. Add one there, add one there. You can color on it. You can make any design you want with these. But because St. Patrick's Day is coming up, I'm just gonna use the St. Patrick's Day colors. You can do all the way around if you would like. I'm just gonna do the tops of them. Well, well, we'll move this one back there. And there. So the next step is we're gonna put the string on it. So you can poke holes in the side if you would like but I'm just gonna take our string from earlier that we had set aside and glue it on the sides. So I'm just gonna grab a little dot right there and I'm gonna stick it on. And be careful as it is hot. And then I'm gonna go to the other side and then stick it on. Let it dry for a few minutes. And then it will look like something like this. And now you're ready to try out your binoculars. I hope you enjoyed this and have a great day. At the end, you should end up with a project like this, a little craft, and then you're ready to go look through your binoculars. And then you can even hang them up on your wall or around your neck, and they shouldn't go anywhere. Thank you for watching.